This plane's first owner flew it right around the world after purchasing the Piper PA-12 in 1947. Today, mechanic Eric Meyer is going to pilot the American aircraft under the watchful eye of his father, Elmar, and his sister, Ennie. That sound is music to the ears of airplane enthusiasts. It's a passion, definitely. It takes you back to the roots of flying, to the simplicity of planes, and the lightness, too. The Meyers are all fascinated with flying. What my son is doing is just great. The whole family flies. That's the nicest thing ever. Daughter Annie Meyer is also training to be an aircraft mechanic. She's one of the few women to pursue this profession. Flying is an adventure. You can see the world from above. It's peaceful up there. You're a little bit closer to heaven. Eric Meyer has loved planes like this supercruiser since childhood. For my birthday, my uncle would always give me a round-trip flight as a present. I was even allowed to steer. That went on for four or five, maybe six years. There was nothing better. <laughs> Today, Uncle Achim is a professional pilot and Meyer Motors flight instructor. Together with his brother Elmar, he runs the family business, which specializes in restoring historical airplanes. The brothers founded the business a decade ago, but the Meyers were restoring and flying vintage aircraft long before that. It all started with their father, a farmer who owned vineyards. He said we need a plane to spray the grapevines. And the barn had to be reconstructed, enlarged, to make room for the plane. And our mother and my brother, we all worked on it. Back in 1965, his father paid 1,200 Deutschmarks for this Fiesler Storch. My father's problem was that he was also disabled. He only had one arm. People said he was being stupid, that a disabled man couldn't and shouldn't fly. It was impossible. But he did. And in 1974, he became the first disabled person in Germany to get his pilot's license. My brother and I went up with him regularly as children, and that's how we caught the flying bug. The brothers even experienced a crash with their father. The plane was totaled, but that didn't dampen their passion for flying. 25 years ago, the brothers bought an aircraft of their own. Today, Meyer Motors employs more than 20 people. In 2011, they found this 1950 Hawker Sea Fury at an air show. The propeller plane could go almost as fast as a fighter jet at the time. Achim and I were in Reno when the plane crashed. The pilot ran out of fuel just before hitting the runway. The plane was destroyed. I read my brother's thoughts and said, we'll buy it and reconstruct it again. Numerous rare or famous flying machines now stand in the hangar or the workshop. Many of them belong to clients, like this P-51 Mustang. Annie Meyer is currently working on a Messerschmitt built in 1934. When you know that you're handling things that are around 100 years old, it's kind of awe-inspiring. And when you achieve something after working on it for so long, when a piece finally fits and you attach it to the fuselage, it's pretty cool. Still, no one in the family expected that Annie would wind up doing her professional training here. It was the last thing I wanted to do. I always said, Dad, I'm not going to work for you. Then I took a gap year and went abroad and noticed how much I missed helping out and getting my hands dirty. After thinking about it a lot, I decided to do it after all. And I don't regret it. I do it all over again. Her brother Eric already knew as a child that he wanted to become an aircraft mechanic. Today, he's one of Annie's instructors. I must say that I was really apprehensive. But as we know how to solve problems from being siblings, I'd say we make a pretty good team. We have a lot of fun at work. I thought it would be a lot worse. <laughs> Sabina Meyer has managed the office from the start. She always brought her children along to work. 
They had their little bicycles with them, and their wading pool stood outside. They helped clean the planes and even built their own from cardboard boxes. They had a lot of fun. The Myers are a family who are still having fun, ensuring that vintage aircraft stay in the air for years to come.